I created an iOS shortcut that makes it easier to add recipes to Mealy. It allows you to import or share a recipe directly from Safari, scan a photo of a recipe from a cookbook or a recipe card, or scan a URL of a recipe that you've previously already imported. Today, I'm going to walk you through how to set up and use this shortcut. In order to use the shortcut, you're going to need three things. You're going to need the URL of your instance of Mealy. You're going to need an API key, which I'm going to show you how to get right now. And you're going to need a Gemini API key. Gemini is a large language model that we use in order to be able to parse the recipe information out of the text on your image and put that information directly into Mealy. I'm using the demo site of Mealy, demo.mealy.io for this tutorial, but you should do this on your own instance. So I'm going to go ahead and log in as admin. You log in with your user. If you click on your user icon on the top left, you'll be taken to your account summary. Here under personal, you'll see user settings and hopefully you see API tokens. If you don't see an option for API tokens, it means you need to enable advanced settings. So under user settings, you could go to manage profile and under preferences, make sure this show advanced features preference is checked and update your user information. Go ahead and update that now. And go back to the account summary and go to manage API tokens. For token name, you can use something like shortcut and click generate. Here you'll have the API token that you'll need in order to be able to set up the shortcut successfully. So make sure you copy that and save it. This copy button won't work if your website doesn't use HTTPS. So I'm going to make sure to go ahead and select all and copy out of that as well. For the Gemini key, you'll want to go to makersuite.google.com and accept the terms of service. After we accept the terms of service, we can go to Get API Key on the left, create an API key in a new project, and it should generate an API key for you. Just give it a couple of minutes in order to make sure that it, everything is processed. Once the API key is generated, we're able to click Copy, and we want to save that for later. Again, this is going to be needed in order to be able to su successfully set up our shortcut. Now that we have all that information, it's time to actually set up our shortcut. You can do that by clicking the link in the description below. Once we get to this page and click Get Shortcut, it'll pull up the Shortcuts app, asking us if we want to add it. The first part is where we need to add our Mealy URL or our IP address with our API port if we're hosting it locally. The next screen is where we need the API key that we got in the previous step. Go ahead and copy that API key and paste it in here. And finally, we need the Gemini API key, which we got from Makersuite. So just put the Gemini API key in here and we're good to go.